step down. I shouldn't call my dad the guy's. Him? No. No, you married into the step. You don't use. Some. I need to watch the very best thing at this exact moment. What, huh? Your son wants to play games that needs internet? Fuck him. Fuck him. He doesn't need that. Like, I'm. Quick, like me, Izzy, and Emerson, and Sophia. Imagine kind of quinge, and my game is broken. If you're not, if you're not watching anything that needs internet, go to your fucking room to watch it. that you're just watching TV on a TV that needs an internet to run. <laughs> if you have a working TV in your room, being themed cryptocurrency. You know, this was not official, it wasn't created by Netflix, but the people who made it did make it seem legit. The starting price was one cent per coin, and almost immediately, people piled on, all rushing in and buying, expecting the value to go up so they could sell and make a quick buck. And sure enough, within a few days, it flew, all the way to $30 a coin. And within a week, managed to hit an all-time high of $2,800. To put this another way, if I'd spent just $50, the game, didn't exist. The developers had promised that they were working on it, but it very quickly yeah. became apparent that they were. Come to end stream and, and we started. Never seen anything like Fallout that came after this. Within five minutes of the scam being outed, five minutes, Squidcoin dropped.